good country? Well, we're making some biscuits and gravy this morning. We're uh, gonna eat this little breakfast around the old camp. We got the old campfire going. It's Thursday. We're here in Brainerd, Minnesota. We're gonna get ready for this hell week. But first, we got to put some good food in our bellies. So we're just making us a little bit of biscuits and gravy. Got me a good little roux going this morning. Now I'm just scraping my pot, let my gravy set up. Mama's gonna make us some biscuits in there. She's inside making some biscuits and then we're gonna eat a little breakfast. We'll let y'all know how it is. Just gotta keep it moving, guys. Keep it moving. See how this pot's nice and clean on the bottom? But I've got all that. I done cooking some bacon in there, cooking some sausage in there. Got all that good burnt stuff on the bottom. And then you take and scrape all that stuff off and get it up in your gravy. That's where the goodness is at. Gotta add some little pepper. In this big ass pot, it don't seem like I got a lot of gravy in there. But I know I do. I put over a half a gallon of milk in this bitch. Yeah, I know we need that. I guess if you had it in a smaller pot, it would be deep, you know? Yep. More flour. What you got, two cups of flour? Keep adding milk. Yeah, probably about two cups. I don't really like it real floury though, you know. If you gotta watch that flour, man, it'll be taste like flour. She got enough though, you let her cook up, it'll it'll tighten up. If you add flour in at this point, you have to mix it with milk. You can't just oh, put yeah. that flour in here. That will be Shake clumpy as fuck. Yeah, it'll be fucking clumpy. We're making dumplings. Never get exactly. <laughs> I can't stand that either. She's coming together. See how she's starting to tighten up? Just gotta keep her moving. My old cooking pot right here, this thing gonna play. Yeah. I think I cook steaks inside this song. I can't <laughs> this bitch right here put some heat on me now. Hey, look at that. Look how the uh, pot clean right back up. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. This pot cleans right up, man. Like nothing. You get some liquid in there, it'll clean all right back up. That's why I like it. I like to get that little bit of burnt get down there, but then I hate a pot that that burnt tin won't come back off. This aluminum pot, that shit comes right back off there. This is a good pot. That will polish. Yeah. Hell, I think this pot is only like 30 bucks or something. It wasn't much. But when you're doing it like this right here, you gotta keep moving. That's the wheel start burning from the bottom of the pot. You think that's enough gravy? I think there is. If you put it in a small pot, it'd probably be up to here. Just I think it's in that big ass pot. It's up to you, buddy. You can always make more. Yeah. Add to it if you want to. If I'm gonna make more, I gotta do it now. Yeah, you can add to it. We'll just let her keep going. I, I think we How's the taste? This bitch got some pepper in it. I'm gonna go get mad about that. She's got a little bite to it. Ready to eat, Wayne? Born. Born ready. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's gonna be good. No butter in there. You don't need no butter. See, it's actually a little dark because we got a good little roux on the bottom of that thing. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I did my chicken and dumplings. I think like they're going to touch the yeah. side, <laughs> but it is what it is. Excuse <laughs> me. Oh, that wasn't me. That was Jordan, I, need to get one. I need to get one of these for us. I need to get one of these for us. Ready for some biscuits and gravy, Brian? Hell yeah. Ready for some. I'm hungry. You think you know, we, we done been to the auto park so this morning. Got some, some uh, microfiber towels, a couple air hose fittings. I mean, so yeah, I'm hungry. Me and Sink went to the post office. We've had yeah, a full morning already. Yeah, full morning. Yeah, y'all forgot you all didn't get up and go to the post office. So yeah, we got some shit done already this morning. Ready for some breakfast. Now we're just ready to feed them bellies. Hell yeah. Then go take a nap. <laughs> 
thickening up. Oh yeah. She's sticking it. She looking good. Oh, she looking real Nothing good. Stuck Nothing stuck on the bottom. Well, if I could only tell you all how good this smells. <laughs> if you could only get smell through a camera. Smell of vision don't exist yet, unfortunately. No, it don't. It don't. But, oh my goodness, does it smell good. We'll just have to, are they getting them really good? Yeah, should I switch them? Let me yeah. get some. Let me get some. Let's the top run hotter. Oh, yeah, they're brown and on top. Now, y'all burn the biscuits up now. <laughs> it's all about you and your little microwave. It's your son's. It's all right. He's got clothes everywhere. I'll be moving, Dad. Can we switch them? Yeah. yeah, your hands. Gotta look out. Oh my god, do you have to really record this? Yes. <laughs> we gotta have everything on video, bro. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ooh, good thing you did. The biscuits are about done. Mm. Not in the middle, they're not. In the middle and on the bottom. No. Nope. I don't think y'all's little fucking microwave. Well, we should have done it probably separate. Okay, let's do it like this. Can we move this one down? You're doing great. You're doing a great job, Bob. Keep it up. We gotta fuck my biscuits. No, we ain't. No, hey, y'all should turn that around, guys. Nope. There's more heat in the back. Hey, did y'all see how they're hotter in the back? Yeah, but we moved them all the way. I know, but I was still rotating. Oh my God, boy, he's getting on my nerves. Rotating, because you know where the hot spot's inside that thing. Turn it. We got the foil. <laughs> grab your hands. No, I'm not burning myself. Not for these damn biscuits. There you go. Now you're cooking with oil. Good gum. This fire is. I guess I'm gonna have to get over there and run that goddamn microwave too. It's not a microwave, it's a. Oven. Oh, fuck it. We're going to rename Mrs. T. Daniel Boone over here. I sat over here this morning, listened to fucking D over here with a torch on the wood for like 15 minutes. She wouldn't lie. I even put a little cooking oil on. She wouldn't lie. I said, man, fuck it. I'm going to let Dwayne do it. So I go in there. I'm, I'm telling mama. I said, yeah, goddamn shit wouldn't light. That raggedy ass wood I come out. Terry got the fire lit up. I said, how'd you light it? Just with a torch. So we're gonna call her Daniel Boone from now on. I guess I should have sprayed it, huh? That's good. We did it. Oh, perfect. It would have been a lot better. Perfect. You got it done in the middle? Yep. got going to our racing program we eat good dinners and good breakfasts <laughs> tonight we're eating steak Ooh. old daniel boone over there cooking steak tonight <laughs> what you think very good he did a good job i could do better but he did good <laughs> we're gonna get our bellies full here we're gonna clean up we gotta pick up camp here and go over and park us i'd like to stay right here where we're at because we've got a little campsite here but you know, because all the fans, they want the fans to be around the racer, so we're going to have to go over and get in the parking lot, get ready for tomorrow and Saturday. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we run good. Hopefully our whole team runs good. I think this is our weekend. I, I got a good feeling about this. We, and Justin ran good here last year, so hopefully hopefully Justin's car breaks out and starts doing what it's supposed to do. Callie's car is doing well. Jim Howe's car is doing well. If we can get John Odom to do good and get uh, Tony McKinney. I think we'll have a strong weekend this weekend. Oh, Big D's going back from round number two. He got two of them biscuits in him. He's going to be stuck. He's going to be needing that. Yeah. You got to get second. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> he got a pile up in there. Oh, yeah. He's going to have to take a big old shit here directly. I just did. I'm filling back up. <laughs> well, hey, we're out of here. We'll see y'all in the next one.